Hi everybody, it's Erin from The Impatient Gardener. Um, I'm going to do my window box here shortly, but I thought I would kind of take you through the steps of how I do the window box because it is high enough that I need to go on a ladder to do it. So I like to have everything set before, before I get up there so I don't end up having to change a bunch of stuff once I get up there because it's not exactly easy access. So what I do actually is I create the window box, design it, here on the steps, lay it all out. I have a rough idea how big it is. And then I just sort of translate that planting to the window box. So I thought you might want to see how I put this together because I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to do. I have a general idea, but it's not until I put it all together that I know what's going to happen. And I have a bad habit of putting too many plants in, especially in that window box. Um, but it looks good from the beginning then. And it's a self-watering window box, which um, is I think probably the only way to go with a window box that's that high because I do have to get up on a stool to get water in it. So this way I only have to put water in there probably once a week or so, maybe a little bit more um, in the middle of summer. Anyways, I thought you'd like to see the process, so here we go. Hi everybody, it's Erin from The Impatient Gardener.